Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a lovely day. Now today is gonna be a taste test stroke challenge. I have seen going around YouTube the spicy ramen Korean, I think they are, noodles. I've been trying to pick them up in the UK. It's not that easy. Unless you want to go on eBay and spend, you know, pay an extortionate amount. I can't find the ones that everyone else is trying. So I picked these up. I'm not too sure if these are the exact right brand, but they're in like in my um, Tesco near where I work. They have like different um, world foods. So this was in there. So I'm going to try these. So I've seen, I tell you actually got me onto this Kim Tai, Kim Tai, Kim Tai. Her and her McBongs. Ah. But anyway, so yeah, she's the one who made me sort of look for these. And then I saw Nick Snyder do it. And then I saw Sanders Kennedy do something similar. Not exactly the same. But. So I was like, I want to try these blinking noodles. I think they're just going to be like the three minute noodles you get, but I'm going to try them anyway. So I'm going to try these on camera with you. I'm blinking starving, so let's cook. So everyone, I cooked my noodles. As you saw, they are here. I'm blinking starving. I've also got my water there just in case they're a bit hot. They do to me just look like in the UK you get like a lot of three minute noodles. They don't look anything special. They don't smell anything special, but here's what they look like. So here they are here. I maybe should have got a knife. I can't do chopsticks or anything like that. I can just about hold a knife and fork. I'm not attempting to try chopsticks. I'm useless. So anyway, Let's just have a little taste. I've let them cool down a bit because nobody wants to be eating boiling hot noodles, so. Oh gosh, they are spicy. But they taste quite nice. Mmm. They are nice. I'm pleasantly surprised. Mmm. Definitely like, they are hot. Definitely like the, whoo, the three minute noodles. Okay, I'm gonna have to have a drink, sorry everyone. They are pretty damn spicy. That's better. But they are definitely like the three minute noodles that you kind of get over here, which is cool. But actually they are a bit nicer so there they are they are nice this is actually turning into a bit of a mukbang isn't it it's not really a taste test it's like a mukbang mmm I actually really like them I think I got them in Tesco and they are hot though I'm not gonna lie Whew, they're spicy and I think they're about 99p, but the packet's quite big and I'm definitely going to get them again. I like them. Mm -mm. I do love a bit of spice. I love a bit of a kick. Yum. So, has everyone been watching Big Brother? Mm. I have been, but do you know what? When Trisha went in, I was so pleased. I thought it was so fab for a YouTuber to go in, didn't you? I mean, the other lineup, let's be real. The lineup of people they have in now, kind of pony, kind of a bit poopy, but you're never going to really get proper A list celebs going in Celebrity Big Brother. I'm just not going to do it. I've got no need to do it. I don't need the exposure, they don't need the money. But, I tell you what, I've been doing updates on it, and for anyone wondering, I haven't really been getting paid on those updates because YouTube's doing a funny thing at the minute with monetization and stuff. But whatever, whatever, you know, whatever the weather. So I've just been doing it for fun and. You know, Sarah has come across strange AF, don't you think? She has come across so bad. Some people still feel sorry for her, which I don't understand why. She brings everything on herself. She needs to keep away from the vino. 
my lord she needs to step away from the wine girl step away step away from the wine she can't handle a drink goes around oh, i like these yum she goes around telling everyone she's an orange aid orange aid what orange juice whatever or maybe vodka with a little bit of orange girl you're not fooling anyone just lay off the drink it obviously gives her a bit of confidence and i get that and did you hear her singing oh my god did you hear her singing last night whenever it was she's so bad so bad but so so bad isn't she oh my gosh <sighs> yeah i don't know and i think the whole her and chad thing very odd i have a feeling people are saying i do don't, i don't think it's 100 percent real i don't um especially as she has did have she won't have now she had a fellow on the outside that she'd been with for a month so she can't have liked him that much because she wouldn't have gone smoochy woochy with chad and he was in the beginning oh my gosh he still is but going in there when she watches back how what chad said when he went into the house saying oh i'm i think i can get any of the girls right now i think you know i'm up to date in any of them <laughs> she's gonna flip she is good if they're still together by then i mean i've only just made it official and in the first 24 hours kind of had the first proper argument and tear from kind of not together again oh blinking out can't keep up but look at these noodles mm. but she's gonna hit the roof when she sees that she's gonna flip <laughs> i'd love to be a fly on the wall when that happens i really really would it's gonna be super cray it's gonna be super Cray, 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 cray. But her singing, jeez. She needed the auto tune. But yeah, after Trish left, I was a bit like, oh no, don't go, Trish. We all see a different side to her than what the other people who don't watch YouTube see. Oh, you're not just walking. But yeah. These are making my nose run, but do you know what? I really like them. I'm gonna get some more tomorrow. Should I do more of these? Do you guys like mukbangs? How do you say it? Mukbang? <laughs> Don't think it's mukbang, it's mukbang. So. So, as I was saying, anyway, yeah, she's gonna, oh, she's not gonna be happy when she comes out of her house, is she? So, I think it finishes, as I said, next week. I don't know when it's gonna be put up. I'm gonna try and put this up as soon as I can. So, it'll probably, yeah, I'm sure it's ending the very end of Aug. I'm sure it's something like that, something like 27th, something like that. I'm sure that's when it's finishing. But, oh, oh, I'm not looking. This is, when I'm filming, this is Sunday. I'm not looking forward to going into work tomorrow. Really not. Who does, eh? But, oh, really not looking forward to it. But I hope you've all had a fab weekend. Let me know what you think about your brother. Obviously, I've been doing my little updates and I've been talking to a lot of you about it. But, I don't know. I think there was somebody that was live streaming it and I think you're not allowed to do that. So, I think they may have got in trouble. I could be wrong. But, mm, these are nice, but, oh, spicy. Mm hmm. But yeah, I'm definitely going to put these up again. I like them. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. 
Yum, 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 yum. Not much left now, look, nearly finished them. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, but I work in London and I live just outside and um, commuting is a killer. I've worked up in London for quite a long time now. I think since my early 20s. And um, yeah, I feel like I've done my time, you know, working up in the big smoke, so to speak. But money's so much better. So much better up there. Even with the commute and your travel, a lot of the time you can earn so much more. There's just more opportunities. That's why I did it. And do you know what? Last year I had a bit of a setback. The company I worked for forever went into administration. But I did what I wanted to do. Mm. Finished. Yum. I wanted to be a production manager like a publishing strip media company and I did it so I'm proud of myself you know oh yum let me have a little bit of a drink they are nice you need to pick them up if you're in the UK and you're like me and you're trying to find ramen noodles because of Kim Thai <laughs> and you don't know where to get them go into Tesco they, if they have the like the world food aisle and it's in the Asian, I think it's Asian Oriental, not too sure. I think it might be like a clash, you know, might be together. They're in there, but they are spy C. Ooh, but they're nice. But anyway, there's my first kind of mukbang. Who knew? <laughs> but anyway, I hope you enjoyed my video. Let me know if you want me to do more videos like this, because I will. You know, I love eating and I love chatting away. Even if I do chat a load of garbage sometimes, I love doing it. So, let me know if you want me to do another video like this because I will. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new and give me a thumbs up, hum, thumbs up, thumbs up, and hit that bell notification button because then you'll know when I upload new videos. As if you want to see me again. But anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Hope you have a lovely day wherever you are, and hope to see you again soon.